Hi there and thanks for watching. So today I thought we're going to look at some of my favorite licks which I came up with when writing this tune. I like this lick because it has a swing feel, which is this kind of thing. It's actually taken from the A minor pentatonic scale, but I'm adding two mixolydian notes. As well as the you know flat fifth from the you know typical blues scale. Um, and I like the lick because it, it sort of ends on a fast staccato run um, and, uh, and with a squeal. And those are created by you know, lightly touching the string with your thumb when you know, striking. Now when playing this, watch out for this place where you're playing three notes in a row with the same finger on the 5th fret I have no clue what the theory behind this uh, lick is. All I did when writing it was I tried to take notes that would be really, you know, out of the pentatonic sound. So I, I took the A minor pentatonic and I made, I made sure I didn't play that scale. Um, it probably has some, some name somewhere, um, but I just approached it that way theoretically and then I made sure I hit every, the wombie bar in every note, or almost every note. Uh, to get that exotic feel. Um, now, it's, it's a quite difficult lick to play, especially to play slow, <laughs> and the reason is because um, you, you don't have your right hand to dampen the strings or to, you know, to prevent the unwanted strings from ringing. Uh, so, you're gonna get a little bit of noise when doing this, um, and the first step to practice this is to do it only with your left hand. Now what I do is, as soon as I can, I uh, put my thumb here to try to damp some strings. Now when you're comfortable with that, you can add the wombie bar. The next lick sounds even worse. Uh, it's this kind of thing. It doesn't really have a, you know, a key. It sounds bad wherever you play it. <laughs> uh, but the way I approached it theoretically was that the pedal note, the one which repeats, which is on the 12th fret B string, uh, that, that, that's a strong note. That's the fifth uh, if we're in the a, E minor uh, tonality. So, so I made sure that, that I have one strong note in there and then the other notes are sort of Either it's either the, sh the flat fifth or the sharp fifth, and that creates a kind of you know altered or just weird sound. Um, so have fun with it, this weird lick. So I hope you're gonna have fun with all of these licks, and uh, I you know once again want to thank you for checking out my uh, lesson and my uh, my song. Uh, it means a lot. Uh, so. Thank you and I really hope to you know be able to produce more videos and do them more often. <laughs> but see it, see it, see it, see it.